Greetings from Farmer Bill, Funds Art, Mays Valley Farm Market and Winery. One of the questions people ask us all the time is, how do you bottle or how do you get wine in a bottle? Well, today we're doing that. I put a little blog entry late uh, a little bit ago about how we did it, but here specifically is our bottle filler and our winemaker, Todd, who's here going to show you a little bit about how we actually get the stuff in the bottle. How do you do that, Todd? Well, today we're bottling Riesling in our uh, cobalt blue bottles that the ladies seem to like. And you take the bottle and it just kind of clicks on there and it gravity feeds into the uh, bottle. And when it's full, it just kind of stops filling. I don't know if you can really see it on the video. We'll just watch it. You can maybe see the bubbles coming. Oh, looks good. And, and then uh, once it's full, it just stops. So they're all uniform and, and uh, 750 milliliters. Kind of wait for the foam to die. And then we just... Pull the bottle off, and from there we'll go over here to our corker. Slide her in, put the cork in the end of it real nice. And from there we, uh, these uh, little capsules shrink right on the top. Put it in a little heat shrinker thingamajiggy, and that's uh, done. It's a real simple process, it doesn't take real long. In fact, we're just about done with this batch. Tell me about that bottle, Todd. Uh, the cobalt blue bottles. Um, it's what they call a hock style bottle. You'll see a lot of uh, German style Riesling, uh, Gewürztraminer, those wines that just have a little bit of sweetness in them. Uh, we don't use the cobalt blue for anything else. It is a, a much more expensive bottle, but uh, by uh, popular demand, the uh, blue bottle is back. So uh, we'll have it here for a little while anyways. Well, that's putting wine in the bottle at Mays Valley. Thanks for stopping by. Take care.